a realistic price prediction for Cardano. Welcome back guys, it's Crypto Rocco from Rockstar Trading Channel. After the Lonzo upgrade and a successful launch of smart contracts on Cardano, I think it's a really good time to share with you my longer term price prediction for Cardano. Look at previously what happened with Shelly Mainnet launch. We'll look at how the Alonzo upgrade is going, how it went and share with you what I want to see in the next coming months for Cardano to succeed. We'll look at Cardano's market cap, compare it to Cardano to some of the competitors and share with you where I think Cardano could be going by end of the year and into next year. And at the end of the video, guys, more importantly, I'll share with you exactly how I'm trading it, some of the key levels I'm looking to buy Cardano if you're investing, some of the key zones that you can look to buy the dip in if we do get a dip, or if you're looking to take trades, I'll share with you exactly uh, how I'm trading Cardano. So without further ado, let's get into the video. So it has it is massive news for Cardano finally launching smart contracts. If you have been involved in crypto, currency uh, you know there's a joke that you know cardano still hasn't got smart contracts after all these years cardano is a different project their their approach is you know very very methodological the way they apply things they're very philosophical and academic approach takes a bit longer than some of the other projects but you, you can look at some of the issues that solana is having so you know it's a, it's a different way of approaching is is to your liking as well do you like cardano's more solid you know slow gradual uh, progress or do you want some quick progress it depends on your taste as well i quite like cardano's vision and again uh, although i've shorted cardano and i've got a lot of hate for shorting cardano but I i'm just a trader guys I, I do invest in cardano and i'm still holding cardano long from less than 10 cent and you know that's why i'm taking profit and you know some of the people in the comment section called me crazy for selling some people said it's awesome that you know your videos are slightly different to everyone else who just keep saying buy 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 don't talk about buying and selling and actually taking profit and making money but I think short time frame, like I said, Cardano could dip. I'll come to, back to the price prediction. But longer time frame, guys, the Alonzo upgrade has been successful. Cardano Alonzo upgrade sees 100 smart contracts in the first 24 hours. And, you know, at the end of the day, this is what we want to see. We want to see adoption. We want to see, you know, decentralized applications built, built on Cardano. Developers wanting to move away from other ecosystem and platforms and building their cool stuff on Cardano. And this is what we want to see. And Charles Hodgkinson and the team are making the right claims that, you know, we've already seen NFTs uh, grow on Cardano without the need of smart contracts. Uh, Cardano is you know, looking at energy efficient uh, projects in Africa and other places. So Cardano, is, you know, is making progress and we just need to see more of this. And no one can say now, yes, Cardano is going to succeed. If you ask me who I think will succeed or who is ahead of everyone else, I'd say Ethereum is a clear uh, ahead of anyone else. I'd say Cardano is probably close second and the market cap shows that we've seen issues with Solana network, but Cardano is still going strong. We've not seen if, if Cardano had, you know, Cardano has a lot of haters, also fanboys, but haters. I'm not a hater i just sold because i wanted to make money i bought so early and i'll share with you if you do get a dip where i look to buy but you know cardano is still i'd say in my opinion the second strongest compared to ethereum and another thing that I like, again, I talk about buy the rumor, sell the news event and, and Cardano is not just buy the rumor, sell the news event because they've got another huge event coming up, the Cardano Summit in 25th, 26th of September. And that's going to be huge. They're going to make announcements and uh, people that I know that I speak to that are closer to Cardano than I am. They're saying there's going to be more partnership, some huge announcements of new apps, and that's going to push Cardano's price up. So we might not get the dip that I'm expecting, but again, I'm still happy to take that bet and I've explained my reasons in the previous videos. Go watch the videos. I don't want to keep repeating myself. But for Cardano's progress, realistic price prediction, uh, they've already launched successfully smart contracts. They've got a big event coming up where they're going to talk about uh, progression and you know the improvement on smart contract functionality, more dApps being built on Cardano. So from short time to longer time frame cardano's future is looking bright to me the question that everyone has the million dollar question is will more people come to cardano ecosystem and build uh, on cardano ecosystem build more apps build more real world use cases apps and that's a million dollar question and if they can succeed i'll come back to the market cap comparison and price prediction that is the 
big question mark on Cardano and any other crypto projects. But we can see there's new apps being built. I talked touched on it in the previous article. We can see more or more stuff being built on Pluto Swap. This is again I love Dex and I wanna you know, I don't want to talk about small Cardano. There's lots of small cap um, stuff being built on Cardano. They they're like the risky 10x and go to zero small projects that we're trading in the rocks are trading them. I don't really want to share some of them with you. Again, please don't invest in Pluto Swap because I'm saying so. But now I'm looking at these small cap coins because Cardano can go 5x, 10x. But if you want the crazy, you know, 100x or going to zero, the pump and dump scams, um, there are some amazing projects you can look into Cardano. Cardano is having uh, the tether coming on as well. There's some really cool stuff that I'm looking at for Cardano. So, uh, we want to see more apps being built. We want to see more use cases. Again, um, I love Dex, so that's why I'm talking about a Dex platform. And this is looking interesting. I'm I'm looking into this project, and there's a few other projects that we are looking at as well. So this was a buy the rumor, sell the news event, and it's probably been not as much buy the rumor, sell the news event. It's holding quite strong, and as long as it's holding above two dollars, I can't say anything bearish about Cardano. So long term, just to review what I've been saying, it's high time frame. We want to see uh, more projects coming with more developers and projects coming to Cardano, more building real world use cases app on Cardano. If we see that, I think, yes, we can make those crazy price predictions that everyone's talking about. If we look at the market cap for Cardano, compare it to uh, Ethereum's Cardano is a uh, is about you know 5x less so cardano needs to could easily 5x if cardano 5x the price of cardano will be you know over ten dollars and and the market cap will be equivalent to ethereum but if you look at where ethereum is and the amount of people using ethereum um we can see that cardano needs to do a lot more to be able to do that and yes if bitcoin and ethereum goes parabolic cardano ethereum's price could be you know five ten dollars and uh, five ten grand sorry cardano could go to ten ten dollars and when everything goes parabolic fundamentals goes out the window like 2017 scam coins were pumping if you think about long sustainable growth for cardano if cardano can get more people building on cardano and growing the cardano ecosystem and functionality and real world use cases then i think ten dollars is a realistic target and again another question mark there's so many question marks in bitcoin i'll share with you exactly how i'm betting on it because you can see rocco saying if this happens that happens is going up or going down i'll share with you how i'm trading when i'm buying but Bitcoin is re really needs to hold above 40k. If Bitcoin holds above 40k and continues higher, I see Cardano going to $10 by end of the year. If Ethereum, Bitcoin, everything goes parabolic, Cardano can pump a lot more. But I think that's a realistic zone we could look at. If Bitcoin dips below 40k, that will be a buy the dip opportunity. And this is where I'm going to come into and say, if Cardano dips towards this level, guys, I'm going to look to blindly buy some Light, uh, Litecoin. I'm going to blindly look to buy some uh, Cardano. And people will say, you know, it's not coming to 150 or $1. I'm not saying it will, but if it does, I'm going to buy. You know, I talked about buying Chainlink blindly at $5 and that ended up being one of the best buying opportunities um you know when when it dipped it wasn't that it was actually not five dollars it was here go watch the videos again all my videos on cardano buying below 10 cent all are on the youtube video and again this was the buy zone this is another buy zone for uh, chain link if it comes there those are the you know you know people make money in a bear market not in a you know on a bull market we buy in the cheap when no one's buying and then we sell at the top like i have sort of done uh, with cardano so that's a long time frame buying opportunity if it gets there. If it doesn't, short time frame, I am still short Cardano. I shared the, this is my friend on Twitter, shared a live trade. And again, people say share live trades. This was shared live and you can see the dip. Um, I shared a couple of trades myself as well. In the Rockstar Trading Group, guys, in the YouTube videos, I share exactly when I'm buying and selling. In the Rockstar Trading Group, I can post my trades. You know, This was a short we took. And you can go watch the previous videos. I shared exactly. I made three videos in a row to live trade with uh, Cardano with you guys. So short time frame, it needs to hold $2. If it dips into $2, you can look for a scalp long. I always say the key zones don't sell into support. If you move up high, I, I probably wouldn't look to short again. I've shorted it here, shorted it here. It, uh, uh, I would probably look to buy the two dollar dip if it breaks below two dollars i would look to short again and then you know target 151 dollar but as long as it's above two dollars it's just chopping around um 
I don't want to take any more new shorts. For me too long again, I would like just chopping around here. And if it starts breaking back above three dollars, you know, next month, uh, I I will start. You know, I will say I'm wrong in my short. I'll exit my short trade and pump Cardano. I think short time frame again without even fundamentals. I think Cardano will head towards you know three fifty four dollars by end of the year from just a trading point of view. If it consolidates and breaks out above and long time frame, I've looked at you know the market cap shared with you what I want to see for Cardano to go a lot higher. But short time frame. This is how I'm looking to trade. Currently, I'm sure uh, I took 75% uh, of that trade and I'm leaving 25% on if it dips lower. If it breaks $2, I might look for another short again. I'm not looking for a short now. There's potential scalp longs if it dips. I'm happy for it to dip once more to $2, but if it goes back below $2 again, I think we'll get that dip. And we obviously need to watch what Bitcoin is doing before we take those trades. So make sure you subscribe to the channel. I'll make Cardano up, uh, updates. There's been lots of people interested in Cardano. I'll try to make it weekly or at least uh, two, three videos a month. So again, make sure you subscribe to the channel and turn on the notification button. If you have enjoyed this video, you can like the video. Guys, if you haven't enjoyed it, thanks for watching anyway. Before I end the video, what is your thoughts on Cardano? Do you think Cardano will take over Ethereum? It will, you know, bring lots of projects coming to Cardano. They'll solve the, uh, you know, energy efficiency issues they're talking about. Smart contracts on Cardano is going to, you know, blow up. Comment below your thoughts on Cardano and comment below your price prediction. So thank you very much. Smash that like button, subscribe to the channel. And I'll see you guys soon with another great video. Go Cardano!